Hello folks from Slide Nerd this is Waves in this video we are gonna see how to do this add subtract multiply average distance you look at this title and you're probably gonna even comment and ask me the question why the hell did I choose to take this topic well let's just say you're right about it this is a pretty simple program there is no need for me to go about and make a vid on this but still it is this last part distance because of which I decided to take this thing up so let's go ahead and see how this is done distance is the only important thing which we need to know about if you take two numbers 6 and 4 the distance between them is either 6 minus 4 or it is 4 minus 6 in short you don't care whether, whether it's the distance is positive or negative you just want that number 2 okay so if you understood what I'm saying let's go to NetBeans and get this baby running so here in NetBeans I have my simple project open, I have written nothing inside, so just a plain empty project with NetBeans filling all the garbage in. I'm going to have two variables, say int a, I'll call it 10 and say b is 14. Well, to be simple, I'm not going to take any inputs in this. I'll say system.out.println. Well, you can simply print a plus b and copy paste the stuff for a minus b, right? a minus b, a into b. Now, comes the average part. Now, let's just run this much and see what happens. Control S to save, Shift F6 to run. Oh, well, 10 into 14. I think it's a big number. I should have taken something small. Probably something like maybe 3 and 4. Let's go and run it. Control S, Shift F6. Okay, now something is working. Now taking the average of these, let's see what the average comes out to be. I'll print this system dot dot print ln and I'll say a plus b. Remember this whole thing needs to be inside the brackets if you want to take the average of the two. a plus b by 2, control s, shift f6. Now here is one tricky part. As you can see, the average is just printing 3. It's rounding it off as an integer because a and 3 are integers, right? So what we need to do is we need a double average is a plus b by 2 remove this print uh, copy paste this print ln down and print avj now let's see what happens control s shift f6 and now at you look at this and you're saying what the hell man i had the average in double and still it's giving me the integer why the hell is this the thing is this you see this right hand side since all three of them are integers that is a b and 2 the compiler actually takes them into integers and calculates it just like before so you need to make this one of them as double if you want the answers in double all right so let's see a we can make this as double it can be also b it's your choice we'll say control s shift f6 and now as you can see the answer is 3.5 the thing is on the left hand side whatever data type you have it doesn't matter but on the right the types of all the three things matter over here so I hope you guys figured that point out. Now let's go to our distance part and see how that is done, alright? So to find the distance, you can say either take A minus B or you can take B minus A, right? Now the best thing is you use a function called math.ab. You give it say A minus B and you simply print this out. You can store this say in a variable called distance and you print the distance out now you guys are probably wondering a minus b it's gonna be minus one but this math.abs function is going to convert this minus one into plus one that's what it does control s shift f6 as you can see the distance is positive but if you take b minus a as you can see b is four a is three so b minus a is one math.abs will not do anything if the number is positive control s shift f6 you see that so this is how you calculate the distance between two numbers it's a pretty simple program i would love to hear from you guys please comment let us know what you think about this if you like what you saw please subscribe to my channel keep watching i'll be posting more vids have a nice day